morning everyone. Welcome to Hillbro and today we are back in Atomic City. And today we are joining a group ride put on by Steve Adams from the YellowstoneDivideTrails.com and uh, Atomic City Trails website. And today we are doing To Hell and Back, which is a ride to Hell's Half Acres. I've never been to Hell's Half Acres. It's east of Atomic City towards the lava flows, kind of towards the direction of Shelly and Firth. And so I'm excited to join this group ride. I can't believe the people that have shown up. In Southeast Idaho, I don't see this type of gathering for side-by-sides very often. It's usually like in the sand dunes. And so for me, it's really fun to see a group of people come together and enjoy side-by-sides for something other than the sand dunes in Southeast Idaho but for the purpose of exploring the desert, doing some desert rides and just coming together as a group. I've personally never really done it before, and so I'm excited to join them today. So I'm not on my double X today because I'm filming, and for me, it's actually easier to jet around on my Renegade. Uh, it's a lot easier for me to just get place to place and just capture the shots. So I brought my Renegade today. Uh, my dad's not here either, but what he's actually attempting to do is come to Hell's Half Acre from Shelly. So my dad lives in Shelly and he's gonna leave from his house and see if we can't meet up together. If we're able to do so, then hey, we know you can connect Shelly to Atomic City and have a beautiful ride in between. So hopefully that happens and hopefully we can catch up with him later today. It's a beautiful May day, one of the best days of the spring so far. The weather finally broke and it's nice, beautiful. It's Saturday. What do you do on a Saturday and it's spring and you got a yard that needs tending to. You grab your wife, you grab your side by side, and you go for a ride. You don't do yard work. Uh, we'll head out towards the, the buttes out there, the big southern butte, tower butte. It's the ride called Hell and Back and we're doing hell to hell and back. And we're gonna let our yard, what Arne? Go to heck. We'll just let our yard go to heck for another couple days. Why not? And we'll do the hell and back ride in reverse and see if we can find Isaac. Does that mean we can still go to heaven? <laughs> Maybe. Love to see the double X's. You don't see them very often, but it's always fun to see, see them out in the wild. Z-Force is another one that you're starting to see more and more of. Uh, kind of a not very well known brand, but uh, starting to see more and more of them. The MRZR has been officially uh, nicknamed the Devil Dog, and it looks like it's out here today. It's fun to see it out here. You can see like the military uh, desert theme to it matches it perfect out here in Atomic City. It's where it belongs. Thanks for coming. I just so you know, I started this thing because I wanted to get into riding, and. I'm a busy guy and I'd call somebody and say, hey, you want to go riding tomorrow? And they're like, I can't go tomorrow. And I could never figure out where to go riding and it was just frustrating. And I thought, why don't people schedule rides and we can just show up and go ride? And it doesn't have to be all weird. So I just want you to have fun. And no, there's no, like, we don't control anything off this property. Be safe, be smart, be courteous to each other and wear helmets while you're on our properties. If you didn't see, we have some long sleeve riding shirts and some neck gaiters that you can use to pull up over your nose and keep the dust off if you want to buy those. And that's about it.
Good trip so far? Awesome. Enjoying so much it? Fun. Yes. How do you like your general? It's amazing. Good smooth ride with the stereo? Uh huh. <laughs> Very good. So Steve, at the beginning of the ride, explained this, but throughout routes through the desert, you do have to cross a few property lines, uh, a few fences, and it's always good to uh, kindly drop the fences for your group. The first guy drop the fence for the group, and then the last guy pick it up. Um, if fence is up, always return it back to up because it's just common courtesy for the people that own the properties uh, that they have their fences put back closed if they were closed before. So always remember to do that if you're out traveling through the desert anywhere, especially Southeast Idaho. If you come to a, a wire fence and you have to put it down, make sure you put it back up. See, a lot of cows. We don't want them moving over from one property to the other. So again, a reminder, put up the fences that you put down. There's a lot of cows out here. Awesome. You got a big group, so you either got to let them pass or... So we just got to the end, to Hell's Half Acres. Uh, so we're halfway on the ride. Now we'll turn around and go right back where we came from. 
and uh, the trail was a lot of fun it is a little rough and rocky the closer you are to atomic city those tra you, you're just driving over a bunch of lava heaves it's a little rough about midway it turns into a really decent uh, trail that you can actually boogie or scoot on and then when you get closer to the lava flows it's smooth smooth and then lava flows and then you traverse over just massive lava tubes lava hills and it's a lot of fun it's not fast through there but it's super scenic a lot of fun to drive through and i'm here with the first group i do believe there's a second group still coming it's a lot of fun to see the different rigs that are on this ride some of them have like really capable rigs that are going really really fast some of them have you know just normal side-by-sides and they're boogieing right along with them and then you have others in the second group who have something of each and they're all just going their own pace and that's what it's all about it doesn't matter what you own as long as you just enjoy uh riding it and that's the important part uh, whatever you got just go out use it enjoy it Well, look who decided to show up. Hey! I didn't see Steve. Where's Steve? He's in the second group. He's uh, way back there. Oh, okay. Uh, so I was with the first group coming out of Atomic City. Mom and Dad, they live in Shelly. And so they left their house in Shelly and met us here halfway in uh, Hills Half Acres. How was the ride coming from Shelly? The ride was great. Went over I-15 and kept heading west through Rising River and I think it's Morgan's Road. And we just kept following it and it ended up right here at this little cove by this farm field. You can see the, the I don't know, the power line. And uh, met up with these guys, all of you. Pretty much the road coming from Shelley is a really well-maintained road until you get to about just right over there and then it turns into kind of a yeah, so the wilderness well, trail. The, the well-maintained road is still a lot of fun because it's going over some lava flows and you're just windy, turny, up and over, down and up, and it's a lot of fun. Little faster. Little faster, but it's a rally kind of fun ride. Yeah. We had a good time. We've been having so much fun. A lot of fun. Yeah. Is this your first time doing one of the atomic rides? Yeah, yeah it, is. it is. Yep. They were a lot of fun, lots of options. Yeah, yeah. absolutely, yeah. Where are you guys from? Pocatello. Awesome, perfect. Yeah. We got lots of couple of Yeah, we got lots of <laughs> We made our Yeah, way. we have a group. I don't know how many is in our group, but. Like 10 of us. Yeah. Anyways, we kept getting lost. But How'd you get lost? Dude, the Onyx maps, dude. Oh, there was one at section the one where it, it tells we you to turn. Where, just... the, where the cows were? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we went straight instead of taking the left at the cows. Well, yep. even after that, too. Yeah. Then we got to a point and said we were on the trail and it was just straight. Yeah. When we finally brush. noticed, I flipped to Yui because I would already gotten the group lost once and I just started mobbing <laughs> through the brush. I'm like, dude. Awesome day. Fun, though. Awesome, awesome day. Dusty. Awesome day. <laughs> Good ride, Dusty though. Bitch. Where are you guys from? I know if I don't know. Awesome. Just right over there. Wouldn't yeah. take you long to get home. <laughs> nope. yeah. Let's go through the rock. <laughs> you guys made it. We yeah. did. Did. Awesome. Yeah. How'd you get in front of us? <laughs> My little secret. <laughs> oh. Did you fly the drone? Did you fly yeah, the Yeah, I just hung, hung, hung <laughs> onto the drone and hung on the four wheeler and took off. <laughs> hey, Isaac. So, uh,. What's up with these shoes? <laughs> these, I so, saw. I wear Crocs all the time. It's just sometimes I forget to change them when I go on a ride. And so, ow, so it just happened. I, so, <laughs> what's happening is uh, I've wore these out so much. Oh, geez, look. No wonder. You're nuts. Yeah, I'm stepping on pine needles through my shoes and it hurts. Do you want me to call you in the morning before the next ride to remind you not to wear your Crocs? No, just mom. <laughs> you raised him. It's not me, right? Yeah. <laughs> 
We're sitting here in Hills Half Acre and had a good time visiting with a lot of good people. Looks like they're starting to head back. And so we're just going to start heading back with them back to Atomic City. I think mom and dad might join us. They'll decide on the trail if they're going to Atomic City or if they'll just turn around and go ahead right back to Shelly. Well, you guys decided to come all the way out to Atomic City. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's a little it, rough. It was too early in the day to stop. And besides that, we couldn't go home and say we did it. <laughs> we kind of do the whole thing. Well, what's fun is we now know you can get to Atomic City from Shelly. Easy. Easy. Other than that last portion the last, part, the last portion is rough but i had never ridden it in hills half acre and it's a lot of fun to ride out there because the lava flows are just beautiful in their own ways especially out in this desert it's just cool fun ride fun group triple we put her car in uh, lexus suv and it's packed it in and right away. <laughs> do i look filthy a little, a little bit a little hairy on the face <laughs> got a little dusty a little dusty <laughs> i gotta see your beard in here <laughs> is that horrible that's not good <laughs> <laughs> this gets the big pieces off well we made it back we made it all the way to Atomic City and back about 110 miles. And there's still daylight left. Do you think we should go work in the yard? We've repented. We'll come back. Well, maybe we'll go work in the yard for another hour and maybe even work in it for 10 minutes. That's, that'll be about enough, right? Anyway, that was fun. Got to uh, meet a lot of riders. All we're having a, a good time. Good day. Fun day. We'll see ya. <laughs>